sponsored by Grammarly. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here as you guys read by the title I'm going to be showing you guys my night and morning routine as a university student It's honestly not that different besides the fact that I've been going to bed a lot later in the night and have been waking up a lot earlier So I just want to show you guys my simple realistic routines right now. It is 9 56 p.m I have a lot of schoolwork to do a lot of note taking to do because all day i've been filming for my other vlogs so stay tuned for that as well because that'll be the episode two of my uni diaries but today is a routine video I would like to take a moment to thank today's video sponsor, which is Grammarly. Grammarly is an online go-to writing tool that can help anyone feel more confident. Since it is now back to school season, you're going to thank Grammarly more than ever. It will help set you up for a successful school year as Grammarly will always be there to support you in every stage of your student or professional life. I've literally used Grammarly since I was in junior high and it has always provided me with comprehensive suggestions to help improve my grades and to save me time in my busy schedule. So Grammarly does offer a free version where they proofread and offer you comprehensive writing suggestions and they also have the premium version which offers a lot more advanced features which also happens to be my favorite tool like students are busy enough with their classes but when you're stuck proofreading your emails your essays like Ooh, it's just too much. But Grammarly Premium's Clarity Full Sentence will help to communicate your message by rewriting hard to read sentences. The best time to start using Grammarly is now, before school gets even harder. Succeed in school by improving your grades with the help of Grammarly. It's literally free, so like, why not? Go to the website grammarly.com slash daisy for a free account. And if you guys like extra features, you guys can always upgrade to the Grammarly Premium for 20% off to help you write your future. I have this poster that I got from Korea just chilling on top of my dresser because I don't know where to put it because I already have one over there like, even though I think it's so cute I just don't know where to put it because I don't want too many teddy bear things in my room like I already have so many <laughs> I once saw this TikTok talking about uni students and how they can never have five things. I think it was like sleep, good grades, social life, work life balance, and healthy meals. I think I'm definitely missing out on the sleep and the healthy meals part because I didn't eat dinner today. I'm trying my best to balance my student life, my YouTube life, as well as my social life. So we'll see how that goes throughout the year because right now it hasn't been too bad, but I'm kind of struggling. <laughs> During the day, I was busy catching up on my econ class and my math class, but now I need to do psychology because I have asynchronous classes, which means we just do all of our classes on our own time, and that is amazing. I really recommend it to anyone that works or that doesn't want to be too heavily involved with school. Being able to balance your own personal life with school is so much better, like in my personal opinion, and asynchronous classes allow that. So. I really recommend it. I really love it. So I'm gonna be doing some of this. I'm not gonna complete it because it's already 10.38 and I've been trying to sleep earlier. Recently, I've been going to bed around like 2 a.m. ish every day and I'm gonna try to pull that up to 12 a.m. of continuous note taking and it was pretty successful so for the rest of the night I think I'm just gonna relax 
changed into my teddy bear pajamas that I got from Korea. Super cute with teddy bears. <laughs> I was wearing makeup all day my skin feels so dry right now like it does not feel good so i'm going to be soaking some cotton pads with my mild like moisturizing toner and just leave it on my face for a few minutes so this morning i had a meeting with the brand for this really fun project that i'll be sharing with you guys not soon not soon at all because it's gonna take some time but i'm so excited to announce it with you guys it's not merch it's <laughs> fun things are coming and yeah so that meeting was like at 9 a.m this morning so i had my makeup on for over 12 hours and my skin does not do well with makeup i'm going to be using some of this snail serum there's really not much anything special to my night routine. I might go make some ramen because I haven't had dinner today. Not because I wasn't hungry, but because I was so busy. And I was like, I can't eat. Like, I need to be doing this. I need to be doing this. Oh. So excited to eat. I got chin ramen, which is my favorite ramen. While that's cooking, I'm going to be currently 9 15 my class is at 11 so i still have plenty of time It is now 9.50. I have to be out the house by 10.15, so I'm kind of in a rush, but it's all good. I'm just using the same product as last night. My skin is still pretty sensitive. I don't think I'm going to do much makeup today. I have my math class and as well as a pre-calc class because I took a gap year for those who don't know. It is the 13th of September and it's still not fall yet. Like it's still pretty sunny during the day, which makes me wonder when fall is coming around because I'm pretty excited for that this year. I said I wasn't going to do makeup, but I'm just using a little bit of concealer. Just cover up the redness on my skin because it's so red. I'm in my first year, so I'm not able to apply for exchange programs yet but i think it's happening for second year students so i might be studying abroad in korea hopefully yonsei day but i just heard a lot of good things about it and even my parents want me to go there so i hope i can go next year or if i don't go to korea probably somewhere in europe because i think that'd be cool but language barrier scares me From my last video, when I told people that I was a business major, hoping to major in either marketing or international business, a lot of you guys were wondering what I wanted to do like after graduation, if I had any plans at all. And I do, I think I either like, these are just goals, like obviously they might or may not happen. But as of right now, I either want to work in marketing for beauty or fashion or um, tech. I think that's enough makeup for the day. I'm only gonna be at school for like, what, two hours, so <laughs> I really don't care.
closed. I just finished my first pre-calc class. I almost fell asleep because I'm so tired, but I'm gonna head to my calculus class now, which is perfect because it's back to back. <laughs> and that was about it for this vlog i really hope you guys enjoyed watching it and thank you guys so much for joining me again this week and spending time with me next week i'll be back with another uni diaries episode so make sure to stay tuned for that and let me know how life is going for you because i like to read all my comments and respond to them so let me know and I'll see you guys next week with my uni diaries. Bye guys. Woke up at 11 o'clock. I ain't got no job. What the hell should I do today? This feel like some I don't give a fuck. Oh my gosh, shut the fuck up. I ain't hearing what you gotta say.